Hey, Dr. Marco here with Regenerate Softwave Therapy here in Hoboken, New Jersey. I wanted to quickly make a recording about our Softwave Therapy machine because Softwave Therapy is a form of Shockwave Therapy. The downside with that is it gets confused with a lot of other styles of Shockwave Therapy. Um, and this energy is very unique and different than the other ones. In the world of Shockwave Therapy, there's different ways of creating that Shockwave. Sometimes it's not even a true shockwave that's created. Other times it is a shockwave that just has a different response in the body. So if you think about shockwave therapy um, in two different categories, the first category is what's actually not even a true shockwave. It's called radial pulse therapy or pulse wave therapy. And what that is, is the piston, sorry, the piston, the head in, of the device has a smaller circumference because it's a focused radial um, device, so it's very focused in where it's gonna uh, put the, sh the energy. But also inside of that um, applicator head, there's like what's, what seems like it's a little piston that would create a mechanical energy or a, um, a type of energy that will that go into the soft tissue, create almost like a, 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 a micro trauma to the soft tissue so that the body thinks there's an injury and it will bring blood to the area, it'll break up scar tissue, it'll do things like that. But it's not a true shock wave and it's not actually regenerating the soft tissue. Um, so that's radial pulse therapy. Then in the world of shock wave therapy, they actually call it extracorporeal shock wave therapy. Now extracorporeal means it's done outside of the body and then shock wave therapy is the type of energy that goes into the soft tissue and creates a change in the body. Now, there's multiple ways that you could create that shock wave, uh, ther that, shock wave that, that is used for the therapy. One way is called an electromagnetic shock wave, which is a great way of creating an en that energy, but it doesn't create the same type of energy and results that this does. Um, it's usually focused in its, um, uh, in its energy. So when you say focus versus unfocused, if you look at the head of this device, it's actually very large in diameter. So all of the energy is actually coming out of this head and going to the treatment area. So we have a much larger uh, surface area of, of um, treatment so we could get more effective and quicker results in a faster period of time. Um, focused shockwave therapy is usually a smaller circumference of the head that is going very focused to a certain area of the body. So being that it's focused, the surface area or the treatment area is smaller, so you would need to do more energy, more treatment over time. So what we might be able to help correct with this machine in say six to eight visits, it may take a focused device, you know, 12 to 18 visits. So the reason why we're able to treat larger surface areas for a shorter period of time is because of the unfocused aspect of this machine. Um, but Electromagnetic is one way that you could create a shockwave. The second way you could create a shockwave is what's called piezoelectric shockwave therapy. Another way of creating that energy, they don't have the most amount of research that shows their effectiveness. Actually, softwave therapy has the most amount of research articles proving that this is the device that's gonna create the best amount of change for soft tissue regeneration. But piezoelectric is another way of creating uh, shockwave therapy. The third one, which is what the soft wave therapy is in, is what's called an electrohydraulic shock wave therapy. Meaning that there is a combination of light, heat, and water, as well as an acoustic sound that creates that shock wave. So just think of it like thunder and lightning. You know, we have, we have thunder and lightning makes that lightning strike. So I could actually turn this machine on and you'll see that there's a little like lightning strike that comes out of that. That's the shock wave that we're using to help to repair the soft tissue. Now what that shock wave is doing, it's different than the other ones, is number one, it is not creating any damage to the soft tissue, where a radial device or some of the other ones could actually cause some micro traumas to the soft tissue. This is actually not causing any trauma to the tissue, but what it's doing is it's going into the soft tissue and creating a biological change. What we mean by that is there's three things that are gonna occur when we put this device on a certain region of the body. Um, number one, 
is it immediately shuts down the um, inflammatory process and decreases inflammation, especially for the first 15 to 20 hours after treatment. So that's why a lot of people that are coming to us are getting immediate change in their symptoms because we're bringing down inflammation. If you think about the cortisone injections that our people are getting or the, the medications that people are being given, the main goal of that is to actually bring down inflammation because a lot of our pain comes from chronic inflammation. This device is actually decreasing inflammation without injecting anything or giving any type of medication. So we can actually replace your medicine and replace your injections with a energy that is more safe and has minimal um, side effects. So the first thing it does, like we said, it brings down inflammation. The second thing it does is it will promote blood flow to the area of injury. What that's gonna do, it's gonna bring the healing components of the body to this area of injury so that it can regenerate it. So we're not just making you feel better in this office, we're actually making you heal better where you're actually regenerating soft tissues that have been damaged for many years. And the third thing, which is the coolest thing that it does, is it actually recruits and brings stem cells that are in our body to repair whatever soft tissue is damaged in that region of the body. So it's really powerful that we are regenerating soft tissue. We're not just making people feel better. Now, obviously that regeneration takes time. So it's not like we're gonna put you on this machine one time and you're gonna you know, have healing for the rest of your life. There is a process that healing takes time and you would have to do this for a certain period of time to maximize the amount of healing that you can do. But within the first eight to 10 weeks after treatment, that's when you get the most migration of the stem cells. And then after 10 to 12 weeks after treatment, you get the most amount of um, new blood vessels going to that area to help to regenerate that area. So this is unlike any other shockwave therapy out there, which is why we brought it to Hoboken, which is why we have two units, one in our Cedar Grove location and one here, because it's very powerful and it's helping our patients and we want to share this with as many people as humanly possible. So um, the other cool part about it, just to add some extra things is, this is also diagnostic. So we're able to see where exactly the soft tissue damage is. So if we take the machine, let's say we're working on an elbow and we put this machine on an area that is normal, you actually feel no reaction from this machine. But if I turn this thing on and I hit an area of inflammation or damage, what you're actually gonna feel is what feels like a little shock or some people describe it as a little hammer hit you. What that is, is it's the body's reaction to the machine. So that's showing you that there is inflammation and damage in there. You don't get that type of biological or diagnostic aspect of this with other shockwave device, devices. So that's why we love this machine. That's why we wanna share it with you. So if you're interested in learning more about um, soft wave therapy, how you could get, um, take advantage of our introductory offer, please call our office, visit our website. We would love to be able to share this with you and see if this device could be the beginning of a new healing for you. So we appreciate you, we love you, and we hope to get to meet all of you and come into the Regenerate Software Therapy to see if we could be a help.